Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all doing well. This video is going to focus on the Quest 2 and how to set up the runtime using the Oculus software rather than Steam VR. The reason you can do this is so you can use the Oculus Tray tool and the Oculus software to run the VR uh, much better with the simulator compared to Steam VR. So right now I'm in the main menu and if I go ahead and click the VR shortcut to activate it, I get an error message saying no headset is detected. You may have seen this before. Um, even though your headset is plugged in or you're switching between headsets, I'll show you exactly how to uh, solve this problem. So this applies to either switching headsets or just setting it up so it runs through Oculus rather than Steam. First thing to do is search in Windows for Reg Edit. It's the registry editor. And if you just click on that, click yes. Once you get to the registry editor, you need to type in the following path. You can copy it from my screen here. You're going to go to uh, Computer, HK Local Machine, Software, Kronos, OpenXR, backslash one. You click on the active runtime. And mine is here. This is what you need to type into the active runtime for it to actually prioritize this path when it opens the VR headset. So what you need to do is just type in this here. It's just a, a path for it to follow and you click OK and close the window. So here we are back in the simulator on the main menu. If I just click on Control Shift to enter the VR mode, you'll see and it goes directly into VR through the Oculus runtime rather than Steam. I hope this video helped you understand how to run the Oculus Quest 2 through the Oculus runtime rather than Steam and it should give you much better results. And please do let me know if you've got any questions in the comments section below. If you like the content, please like and subscribe. And as always, guys, take care and stay safe.